Hello! Today we're attempting the hardest achievement in Outlast, where I have to beat the entire game with no respawns, so that means if I die I have to replay the entire game from the beginning again. On our journey we're playing as Miles Upshur who is going after Murkov in the Mount Massive Asylum after hearing suspicious activities. Murkov has been experimenting on their patient which drove him crazy, and now they started to kill each other. Miles' mission is to investigate based on a lead from a former Murkov worker to see what's going on. So that's it and let's get into the video. I hope you enjoy. All right, let's see if I have still it in me to run this game on insane mode. Don't mind me, just goofing around. We've made it into the building, so that means we have to find Chris Walker. Hello, Mr. Goofballs. Alright, we had the encounter with Chris Walker, so let's grab the keycard and get to the office. I guess he's a trader fanboy, so that's why he attacked me. After the teabagging session, it's time to go into the office. Okay, we do this just for the fun. That is so weird. Yes. Nice, we got it this time. Unfortunately, Father Martin turned the engine off and we're getting a visit by Chris Walker, and it ended up in our first staff, sadly. After an unfortunate incident with Chris Walker, it's time to turn on those two generators, but it was really easy to be honest. What we do here next is using a small glitch so I can go back to the door. All we need to do is hold the door and push it a bit straight and then go back and then cast the whole thing through and that's it. Use a small glitch right there. After 
After turning the generator on, it's time to go back to the office. Using another small glitch here, all you have to do is look back and then run. What we have to do here next is turning on the generator so we can open the door and escape. Okay, we're gonna freestyle this. Okay, we need to dodge this as well. We didn't. We should be good. We did it. Okay, that was pretty easy. Now we get to the shower key room and then after that we will meet up two naked men, which is really... What the fuck? Okay, that was a pretty weird encounter, am I right? But let's push this button, what should happen, right? Look at him. Well, that's unlucky, I guess. Well, since we survived the explosion, it's time to continue on our journey, but, um, what the... Why is he here? Okay, we're good. He doesn't even see me. Well, this place seems very familiar, and oh my god, it's two of my friends, Sonata and Ernie. They're gonna give me a hug, surely. I love my friendly friends, they are very kind. It's time for another two valves to turn on again and then we escape. Okay, we're good. Hello. What we do here is some bunny hopping so we are fast so Chris can catch up with us. Oh shit! That was close. We were gonna do his ass. He swung? Enjoy the intense moment in a moment. Yeah. 
We're not done yet. Sonado's favorite character in Old Last. You mean the right choice here, buddy? You, you wanna head out and take a stroll? Go ahead, I'll wait here. Go on, run free! <laughs> I'm in no hurry. No? Alright. No, my Now! Push this out so we have no issues later. He swung. Yet, but soon. It was a good ride, Trigger. Goodbye. Now is turn on the sprinkler so we can extinguish the flame. Next step, survive quick walk. Why is he not seeing me? And he lost him. That was close to Chris, but we'll hold up. Okay, after getting dumped by the trader lava, it's time to get the key and go to the next place.
did you lose me? Made it to the next place, and there's Father Martin. Oh my God! I'm beginning to understand. I hate this part of the game. All what we have to do now is get two more keys, so we can get the key from downstairs. How is this man also not seeing me? Are they lying? Close this door. Because they don't know how to open doors, that's the funny part. It's a fact indeed. Grabbed all the fuses, now we can go downstairs and get the key. Look at him. Were you ping? Sure. And now we're out. Just slamming some doors behind me so you can catch up with me. <laughs> Time to head up upstairs with Father Martin. Well, we lost our cam. I guess I have to go get it. Another traitor fan incoming. <laughs> Finally, we can go up. But who is this guy next to me? What the? Well, after getting jump scared, it's time to go to the church to Fata Martin. <laughs> Using the same glitch as before again so I can go and play Clash of Tales on my phone while the cutscene is going.
If you don't know how to use the door glitch, you can cross till the end of the room. There are two doors, just open them both and loot Chris Walker. And then just run away from him and you're good. Well, we're slowly getting to the end, which means we're at the lab. That means once you finish this place, you get the achievement. Well, that's it with Chris Walker. Rest in peace. <laughs> As for our last mission, what we have to do again is turn off some valves and then get rid of the life support for her. I don't know his name anymore, sorry. And then we will get a tag, but that's fine. But then we will get the achievement and beat the game. Congrats. We're getting slowly closer to the valve and after that we will go get rid of the life support and then that's it, yeah. That's it, and now we should get rid of the life support and then we're done. GG. Well, my man is dying and we're running. GG. Well, at this point, basically, you beat at the game. Well, congrats. Well, to whoever made it this far, I really appreciate you for being here and yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video and I will see you next time. Laters.